So the effects of global climate change far reaching and from warmer oceans causing more intense hurricanes to precipitation trends impacting food security. According to the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change, studies have shown that yields of some crops like maize and wheat in many lower latitude regions have been negatively affected by observed climate changes. Being Shark Week, well, we wanted to know if climate change is having an impact on the food security of sharks. To some extent that is happening, that natural food chains are being disrupted for a lot of reasons, including climate change, including habitat destruction, including humans eating all the prey fish. That sometimes means large predators being in waters that they weren't really found in before. Uh, this would not cause them to eat humans. We are not on the menu, but certainly it may make it slightly more likely that something that they're pretty sure isn't food, but not quite sure that they might take a taste. Um, and this could potentially lead to some unexpected encounters between humans and wildlife. And it's, it's always good to be aware of your surroundings uh, when, you're in, when you're in the water. Slightly more likely to have a nibble. All right, Dr. Shipman did say that he does expect to hear more about shark bites this year as more people are now getting out and vacationing following the height of the pandemic. Now, he says it becomes a numbers game where more people are at the beach and in the water, so extremely unlikely events like shark bites might become a little more likely. However, he adds that more people die each year falling off a cliff taking a selfie than are killed by sharks.